Hello, my name is Toby from Art Master Studio and today I am reviewing this uh, Far East Watchtower from Sarissa Precision. I will link their website in the description below. This is a 28mm piece, it cost me £12.50, um, which I think is extremely good price. Um, I tried making one of these myself last year and it didn't go as well as this, it didn't look anywhere near as professional as this. This is very realistic looking. It's got a detachable roof. Um, you can glue it on, but I decided to leave it off because obviously I want access to the top area. Up here I've got a 28mm cobblestone castings figure to give you some idea of scale. Um, but it's you know the perfect vantage point for any sniper um, for your games. So it comes on a flat pack sheet, as I'll show you now. So you just pop them out of this. You have to be quite careful with the pieces like this here. Um, it can be tricky to get those out without bending or trying to, uh, you know, snap the wood. You have to be very careful. I used a craft knife and had to had to prise away a few pieces. But for what it is, it's it's worth spending a little bit of extra time just trying to get them out safely. Once you've got them out, you can assemble them following the handy guide that they send with the packet. This has got a step-by-step -step process, along with a diagram showing you how it all slots together, and then a picture of the final product. So if you do get confused, you can just refer to this. So it's very easy to put together. I, I use wood glue to hold mine together, and it's very sturdy. My only negative is because there are some fragile elements, such as these little bits sticking out here, this one actually broke off because the laser um, machine had cut all the way down, and it was quite fragile like I could just push it and it would have just snapped off so but that's you know that's the only negative I had to glue that piece on but you know it's fairly sturdy now it's the same on this piece here but this piece actually stayed on so it's not all bad uh, but yeah just you know just be a bit delicate with it and you'll get a really nice looking piece like this it's got a nice ladder in the middle as well ample room to get any figures down the bottom there that you want to climb the ladder so would I recommend this product? Yes, I would indeed. They do actually very nice range. They've got Old West, North American, Gasland Pally, World War II Europe, Dark Ages, Far East, uh, South of the Border, Japan, City Block, uh, and some sci-fi stuff. So there's a, a large range of different buildings and pieces there, and I'm very excited about getting my hands on some more of these. Uh, the prices, again, are, are very reasonable. The only problem is on the website, they have pictures for everything, but they don't really do it as much justice as what I saw at the show. At the show, I saw all of their pieces on display, and I was very impressed. But the pictures are a little bit small on the website. But, you know, you can make out what they are and make your decision based on that. Uh, but I would definitely recommend this company, and I will be buying more from them in the future. So, if you like this review, please leave a like and a comment, and I'll see you on the next one.